what's the pattern here? How are we getting from 80 to 40 or 40 to 20 or 20 to 10? Some students might say, well, oh, I'm subtracting 40. 80 minus 40 is 40. But you see how it doesn't continue? 40 minus 40 would be zero, not 20. So here you can see we're actually multiplying by one half. And if you want to verify that or just make sure, take the term divided by the one before it. So 40 divided by 80, that reduces to one half. Or 20 divided by 40, that reduces to one half. Uh, and you can see you keep getting that same common ratio of one half. So let's go ahead and uh, write a formula first. We'll say a sub n equals a sub 1, which is the value of our first term, 80, times our common ratio, 1 half, to the n minus 1 power. So if we want to find a sub 12, we're going to put in 12 for n and simplify. So a sub 12 is equal to 80 times 1 half to the 12 minus 1, which is 11. 